экстремистские тоталитарные секты. Секта, так называемого лидера This is the demonstration by the God's Embassy Church building. This act is against foreign preachers and Pastor Sunday. Niggers, go climb up on the palms. 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 Can I make Sunday an offer? I'd like to offer Sunday a job as a porter. He should come and help us build houses here in Ukraine. Good luck. Sunday is a criminal. 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 These are representatives of the Ukrainian Conservative Party and informal youth organizations. Also represented here are the Campaign of Undocumented Immigration and Youth Nationalistic Congress. Black people are the lowest of all kinds, and I don't care if they're offended by it or not. Have they done anything good? Is there any nigger scientists? No. Only emotions are inherent in this race. Intellect isn't inherent in them. They can teach us nothing. How far do you intend to go with their struggle? First of all, this is a warning. We are drawing the attention of our people and our officials to this problem. Ukraine is becoming a refuge dump. Ukraine is now being inhabited by racial strangers. Tell them that he is not needed here. If he won't stop his interference, we will find methods to stop him. I have a question for Pastor Sunday. Many Nigerians, your fellow citizens, are among those who are arrested for drug dealing. What is your opinion about that? I understand what they mean by throwing these bananas at me, but may the Lord bless them. Jesus teaches us to love everybody, even our enemies. So I want to say that I love this man. The charismatic leader of this extremist totalitarian sect, Sunday Adelijah, adheres to the doctrines of the New World Order. Some years ago they made a decision to get a hold of power in our country. So what we are faced with here is not only a danger of public disorder and immorality, but also the danger to the national security of Ukraine. There is a sect in Kiev which has Sunday as a leader. It is a Negro religious group. They conquer other religious groups. When Chernovetsky says that he is an Orthodox, and after that he kisses with the sectarian Black Sunday, who defiles the souls of our youth, he lies. Because true Orthodox cannot embrace, support, and finance the sectarian. We will defend our Slavic Kiev to the bitter end. People elected Sunday. We don't need any Sunday. This slogan means that they cannot buy us with free meals. We also know that the mayor, Chernovetsky, is a member of Sunday's sect. It is a terrible sect. We understand that Sunday is a presbyter. He has great power. Actually, we elected Sunday as the mayor of Kiev. Our saints that are buried in Orthodox monasteries would flip upside down in their grave if they knew what is happening. I have never seen Kiev in such shame before. That is why I am here. We must defend our nation. Information agency Zakiev summed up the results of a public opinion poll. A picture of a four-headed dragon was posted up on the internet. The task was to eliminate one head, so only three are left. They used heads of different public officials. First, the Speaker of Ukrainian Parliament, Alexander Moroz. Second, the city mayor of Kiev, Leonid Chernovetsky. Third, 
senior pastor of a popular church in Kiev, which experts consider to be a totalitarian sect closely connected with Chernovetsky, Sunday at Elijah, and Prime Minister of Ukraine, Viktor Yanukovych. There were 10,500 responses. Respondents chose Pastor Sunday Adelijah to be the unnecessary head, and Leonid Chernovetsky was the most suitable man between all four heads. But, in many experts' opinions, these two men are closely connected, and the success of one is based on the support of the other. Thus, three-headed dragon turned out with the head of Yanukovych, Moroz, and Chernovetsky. The Ukrainian press also pays much attention to Pastor Sunday. The Ukrainian version of the international magazine for men, Maxim, posted an article entitled, Hang Them and Shoot Them, where the author offers a reader to shoot a few targets. Among them are different musicians and public officials, like the leader of God's Embassy Church, Pastor Sunday, and the mayor of Kiev, Leonid Chernovetsky, who is a member of God's Embassy Church. If he won't stop his interference, we will find methods to stop him.